Welcome all praise the Dhamma. For this session, wake up with exploring and letting go. Just keep explore, exploring into your heart what you got, good or bad. Okay? Just, just explore more and more. But when you forgot, Listen, let it come back. Listen is a good technique because you don't have to do anything. Or oh, even you listen and you don't listen anything. No worry. Because when you're listening, you are the owner of your house. When you're listening, you are in your house. Okay? Just want you to be back back home but when you're not listening you enjoy your gossip you enjoy your listen to something else you enjoy your delicious food okay whenever you just uh, keep listening keep listening it become emptiness emptiness more emptiness more emptiness automatically because when you are at home your home will be clean and cleaner and much cleaner okay <laughs> you don't have to fight with defilement or gilesa don't have to you just stay home gilesa want to come cannot come okay listening to your heart listening uh, you listening to your heart it's not the voice it's the feeling feeling uh, desire anger uh, ignorance okay or want to do that why why want to do that if you want to do that with desire no no I not low down when you let go desire okay just intention to do, okay? Listening. Listening, little by little in the day. Then your heart become clear, clear. And then you got good heart. You don't have to practice meditation because good heart comes there already. Good heart. Okay? Wisdom they are already. Understanding things as they are already. Just uh, listening. And sometimes to put the power to your heart. Smile to him. Okay? He is the pure mind. He needs smile. Okay? Smile. Okay? Your body needs food. Your heart needs smile, okay? <laughs> smile and breathing, breathing naturally. Naturally, okay? So now, when you listen, start to listen, you come back home. And then you can see all defilements. There are three groups of defilement. Uh, the rough, very rough one is desire, anger, delusion. And more subtle one is the uh, five hidden. Always for sleep, for sleep. <laughs> Always thinking a lot, okay? For sleep thinking a lot and not feel good. It's the five hidden, okay? we have doubt, doubt, okay? Okay? And more subtle, more subtle is, is the, uh, is the residue. Really subtle residue, gilesa, residue. Or in Bali we call sangyot, sangyot ten. There are ten residue. Deep inside, in your perception. So then, when you smile, you can let go rough defilement. 
Anger, no anger. Smile, not anger. Smile, no passion. Smile. Because you love yourself better than you love other people. Love yourself. Love peacefulness. Okay? Okay? You never realize the test of peacefulness. Then you try to look for other, other test of happiness. But this is the, the best one. Huh? The best one. Uh, the test of freedom. Okay? <laughs> test of freedom. So that's why we use the word test, test of Dhamma. Then you have to feel. To learn about Dhamma, you have to feel how it is. Okay? Not think how it is. <laughs> loving kindness. What is loving kindness? How? Loving kindness? You think you don't understand. You just loving kindness more and more every day to people. You can test, test of the Buddha, test the Buddha teaching. It's so peaceful and it's so so nice, good heart. So that's why now, if you uh, break five pieces, you can test inside your heart now very ugly very disturbed okay but when you took five precepts oh it tastes good okay then you listen in the taste of Dhamma and explore how how much more uh, taste of Buddha teaching deeper and deeper that you still not develop more and more okay so Dhamma of the Buddha is many level, deep, deeper, subtle, and more subtle. For example, when you practice meditation, uh, you must learn to test how the quietness is. Quiet. Quietness. Quietness. Okay, then you know it's great quietness. It got calmness. It got understanding. You never quiet speaking a lot. Okay, you just quiet and listen to to those speaking, and you just quiet. You can understand what what they need. Ah, oh, you you know you know how to talk to them. Quiet first, quiet. So, how? Feel inside with quietness. Feel inside with calmness and humble. Calm and humble, quiet in your heart. This is the test of calmness, okay? You want to develop meditation, practice meditation, but you never go into the ne meditation because you never test it, how it good. <laughs> Today I just bring to you, test first. You want to practice meditation, maybe maybe you don't like it, maybe you change your mind, because it's only quiet, calm, humble, nothingness. Those who always enjoy life outside, uh, maybe don't like meditation. <laughs> Make sure you like it. Test first. Quiet. Calm. Can you test? Not by thought. By feeling. You are feeling like a hand. You have awareness of feeling. Go to feel. Touch. Taste. Deeper. Can you go to feel inside deeper? Feel, feel inside. When you feel inside, is the light inside? Before you got darkness, but you feel, feel you wake up awareness inside. Even you uh, got suffering, feel into your suffering. You cannot fight suffering. 
because when you feel into your suffering it become uh, letting go and freedom where suffering feel where suffering feel because when you got mindfulness and awareness suffering gone <laughs> okay <laughs> feel okay so feel until you see the way but the way sometimes dark I tell you listen more listening more listening you put a torch light seeing inside more listening you bring the spotlight to see the way inside it getting dark more listening more listening more listening you know like the fluorescent bright okay you keep listening 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 uh, not serious not serious doesn't matter how you see how how good doesn't matter listening 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 <sighs> now it's calmness you got calmness listening 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 quiet okay calmness peacefulness tranquility bliss joy freedom do do you like this test yeah <laughs> so you practice meditation and vipassana you never test then you don't know how to go there so easy i just bring to you to test first calmness quietness peacefulness okay relaxation okay and smile and tranquility okay and shining you got it already even you don't know how 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 to or what the method but you already realize the test of calmness test of meditation so when you know already you don't you don't worry what method to go inside just you have intention to go inside or intention going back home okay this is your home your home is quietness calmness peacefulness okay relax letting go and tranquility this is your home and more emptiness now we come back home just come back home you go into meditation in one second by intention letting go everything and back home you don't have to watch the breathing watch the rising body because you got awareness arising it become sensing 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 uh, more and more taste inside sensing and more learning how taste it is how it tastes sensing 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 so in your life when you know your home here and you taste very good taste in your heart and then you you there at home in the beginning when you before you cross your eye you come back home okay in five seconds normally you don't know where you're home even you practice meditation even you watch the breathing but you don't know where is your home how your home is you don't know when you don't know then you maybe take one hour going around beating up beating the bush okay not go back home okay okay just watch the breathing but don't know where the home watch the rising one falling one don't know where the home but if you know where the home is just intention to go back back talk to him your son my son not naughty we go back home together 
wake up. Okay? This is the way that I go into meditation. By intention to go to stay at home. And now my home more purified. First, I taste the calmness, peacefulness, tranquility. But more is open up. There is next room inside. In your house, you have only one room? No, you have at least, I think, two, three rooms. Huh? <laughs> okay? This room is calmness. And then, just intention. Anymore, I did not test it anymore. Then you explore it, explore it. Just do meditation by intention. No formal practice, no formal method, no. Only intention. You can cooking, you can watch television, but get boring television. Back home better. Then when you watch television, you peaceful, tranquility. Oh, so so calmness. Then, then you turn off television. Just stay still. <laughs> Going inside. Okay, this is uh, the natural way of enlightenment. How? I just tell you, open your heart by smile. Then you can know the part by yourself. Smile. You can see inside. Quiet, calmness, but it's so deep, deep and deeper. But if you like it, just have your intention. I want the calmness. Okay? The same. You tell your heart, I want love. Oh, a lot of passion. I want, I want whatever. Gilead or defilement come, okay? But you just say, no more. Passion, very hot. Desire, very hot. Anger, very hot. Oh, I burn myself. Oh. Now, I need calmness. It come by itself. You are naughty boy, know where the house is, okay? But your thought don't know. Your naughty boy know. Just you, just have intention. I want, okay? I will let go. Have intention, okay? Uh, want the calmness? Never mind. It different. You want something outside. Want the calmness is good, okay? But after you enlightenment, you don't have to want any calmness because you are become one with. Pureness already. Okay. First, I want calmness. Now you say to your heart, I want calmness. You go back inside. Already. Calmness is so good. I enjoy calmness. I want calmness. I enjoy calmness and close your eyes, do nothing. Just feel the taste of calmness. Then it will go deeper, deeper, deeper. Don't have to watch the breathing. Okay? Don't have to watch the rising falling. That only exercise. But now you pass exercise already. Okay? I want calmness. And I want smile. I want bliss and joy and cross your eye. Already there. In your heart, it become absorption Deeper absorption of calmness, deeper absorption of peacefulness, deeper and deeper 
and you can see it go deeper, deeper. The feeling like the calmness. There are many, many calmness inside. When you want calmness, do nothing. You go inside. Room, next room, next room, next room, next room, or deeper, 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 and until you find very good calmness there, you got equanimity of mind. There, you got equanimity of mind. Then, automatic awareness will come up. You don't have to try to know the breathing. You got automatic awareness when you get into calmness. That's right. And you know the breathing from the pure mind in your heart. When you go to the pure mind in your heart, is awareness automatically about this guy. <laughs> this guy, the funny guy, uh, getting uh, older, older, uh, teenager to uh, adult, adult to old age. This guy, funny guy, funny, funny, uh, never enough. Even uh, older, getting older, this guy never enough. Funny guy, okay, <laughs> never enough. Even the last minute. Uh, the king of that come still attachment funny guy okay <laughs> you want calmness then it already there close your eye again just just your heart with calmness okay this is your determination no more anger is hot. No more. Passion is hot. Desire is hot. I want clear mind and cross your eye. You got smile and more smile in your heart because you want clear mind. Then your your heart become smiling heart, smiling heart, and your heart wake up with smiling heart, seeing clearness inside. More clearness inside, waiting for you to realize. Just you have right determination. I want peace. I want freedom. How you know you get freedom? You will know because when you go into the freedom in your heart, you will have automatic awareness. How you sit, how you breathe, how you are feeling, and so on. Now you just stay inside with peace. With peace inside, you will know how this guy is sitting, how this guy is breathing.
And when you go there, you need power. Just mind to your heart, to give power to your heart. More smile in your heart, you will got power. Going deeper, deeper, and deeper. And there, peace and tranquility and equality of mind there. And there, we call the knowing. The knowing not move, but all other things move, 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 move. All other things moving, moving, moving. That means you are knowing not move. Your knowing is knowing. But you can know your body sitting, move, moving, moving with breathing, with uh, rising, falling. So you rely that is uh, illusion, okay? You stay at illusion for a long time. Now no more illusion. I know the truth that my mind not move. That means no formation of my, my pure mind. That means my mind is the knowing. Knowing is the knowing. Knowing, not move, but what you know, always move. So, better stay with your knowing. Knowing, when you stay with your knowing, then your knowing become clear knowing. Clear knowing more and more. When you are clear knowing, wake up. The body calm down. The mind calm down from thought and emotion. In clear knowing, you can see the calmness of body, the calmness of mind, and then pure mind in your heart. The Buddha nature wake up. Oh, the Buddha, Buddha nature is inside. Just you want to come with the Buddha. Before you practice meditation, but you never want to come with the Buddha. You still want to go traveling, sightseeing, then you will far from the Buddha. And smiling. Smiling to your heart. Smiling will get more sensing. Okay? Smiling to your heart. Smiling from your consciousness. Not only from your face. From the overall consciousness. Smiling inside. It got sensing. It becomes sensing. Sensing. Now your awareness becomes sensing, sensing, sensing no selfness, sensing with ourselves, okay? And it becomes clearer, clearer, like a big mirror, wake up with good exposure to see inside more and more. Before inside is dark, now inside got light, the light of wisdom. Sensing, sensing, you got more understanding. Sensing, sensing, sensing. So, we all practice from heart. You can close your eye, you can open your eye, doesn't matter. Even you open your eye, you still be able to practice from heart. Uh, you can open your eye, in your heart, with good, with right determination, to come back home. Only one word. Stay home. Then you got intuition, knowledge, awareness, wake up. Okay? So this we call. You got right understanding and right determination or right resolution. This is the wisdom. 
in the noble eightfold path. Noble eightfold path start start starting with right understanding, right right resolution. Okay, this is right resolution. So today I teach you how to go into the pureness, the nature of mind, following the noble eightfold path. All you practice, all you practice. Any method you practice, you must uh, adjust to the noble eightfold path. Starting with right understanding, then right resolution. If you have right resolution, right determination to go back home, it will go back home by itself. Okay? But if it not go back home, maybe you use your, your mind in your brain. Looking for home, thinking about home, it not go back home, because everything is from heart. Okay. In the practice, maybe you use the mind. Your mind watch your breathing. Your mind watch the rising falling. This is only beginner. In in the advanced level, I just decided to go back home, no more. Okay. No, no, lust, desire, passion, or attachment, no more. If you have this right determination, immediately your, your heart cross over to the other side where the Buddha and all enlightened masters stay there, okay? But now you cannot jump over. <laughs> you cannot jump over. Because you don't know how to feel. Today I teach you how to feel, how to listen, how to see, okay? How to understand, how to absorb. Trust in the Buddha. You absorb to the Buddha, the other side. If does not absorb, if it's not absorbed, maybe you always use the thought to think where it is, where it is, you cannot go. You must be like simple person. Okay? Uh, I want peace, peace come. Okay? I want to back home, you back home. I want to become one with Buddha. Okay? So, this is we call you must have the five faculty. The first one is trust in the Buddha. Sometimes you go inside with the power of faith and trust in the Buddha. Trust in the Buddha, faith in the Buddha. You heart go home or not? Go home because you always do dana, okay? Always you uh, do good, okay? Help people. With loving kindness, okay? Uh, this is according to the Buddha teaching. Do good, not do bad. Okay. And the second power is your right effort. Right effort to let go. Not right effort by serious practice meditation. No, not, not, not right effort. <laughs> Like effort in, in your heart, not on the body, okay? In your heart, okay? Right effort. Are you sure? You let go. Let go everything. Ignore. Ignore. Even the phone ringing. Ignore. Then it's just a song. <laughs> a song. <laughs> ignore, ignore, ignore. Okay? <laughs> it depends on your heart. Okay? In your, in your heart. Now, it's coming up, it disappear. Okay? Then you see the truth. Thing cannot stay for long. It's coming up, disappear by itself. Okay? Now, when you let go, sometimes inside, not, let, not allow you let go. Because you have bad karma. <laughs> okay? <laughs> you have bad karma. Oh, really? Disturb. Uh, 
But anyhow, if you just I teach taught you uh, uh, the first session, the first night, just see how this guy doing first. Don't put your selfness selfness into the practice. Just see how this guy sickness. Just see how this guy sickness so that okay. You can know how to put medicine, okay? How to give medicine. Just say by your wisdom. How this guy sitting, how this guy relax, how this guy breathing, and see this guy like, like a factory, okay? Factory. It can stop any day. <laughs> this factory <laughs> don't know when it stop. Okay, now still work, but one day stop. Now your wisdom become more and more. And then in daily life, when you develop this wisdom, see how you work, how you speak, how you think, and then. Your wisdom, you tell, tell this guy, you still not enough. I ask you, why, why do that? Still not enough. Sometimes they follow with you. I need it. I need more. <laughs> okay. Then you stay with wisdom. No, this is the cause of suffering. Okay. Then this mean you. Uh, very, did you are your boy very naughty? Okay, but if you have five precepts, it's not naughty. Okay, it's not naughty. So, you know inside, you got desire. Uh, this one people say not do, but you want to do. Okay, <laughs> this one good, you should do. I don't want to do. This one not good. I want to do. Okay. <laughs> so teaching this boy, naughty boy. Okay, by wisdom. Seeing the cause. Okay, the result. If you do it, you got suffering. You can try. Even you think to do, you got nervous already. Okay, so you must train this guy to see the four noble truths. Four noble truths. Okay, suffering, the cause of suffering, the cessation of suffering if you let go, and the way to the end of suffering if you wake up. Okay, if you wake up with understanding. So now this session, we have learned a lot. For understanding, just understanding peace. Can you now you you want peace until you understanding peace is excellent. Now, every moment in your day life, you got calmness, mindfulness, meditation, the whole day without practice. Okay, because. You got understanding. Peace, very excellent. So that why, when you, before you finish meditation, I always told you, reveal how you feel. Oh, today excellent. Then you will got this in your heart. Next time, you got understanding. Peace is excellent. It will tune up. You come back, coming inside very fast in three seconds. Okay, but every time you finish meditation, then get up. You not reveal anything. You not reveal what you got, what you feel, what your experience. This this session, then you don't have wisdom. You just do and finish. Go home. Do and finish. Take a bath. Do and finish and watch television. Then you start 
one two three one two three all the time okay but if you finish meditation just taste just feel the calmness until you like it until you understanding it next time you need only sit and breathing one or two times then you go inside already <laughs> in 10 seconds okay so now can you uh, test feel your, your feeling inside feel the test of freedom can you reveal reveal how you feel and now I want calmness I want to go back home and close your eye don't have to watch anything just go back home you know the way already okay just I will go back home and cross your eye now he is on the way back home seeing seeing feeling feeling understanding understanding exporting exporting seeing seeing letting go letting go more letting go more seeing more seeing more exploring more exploring your your house the door open welcome you to come to welcome in home your home you are the owner welcome home now you are in the in your home with smiling heart with the my understanding knowing seeing understanding knowing and seeing knowing seeing with understanding knowing seeing with understanding now you can come back home by knowing seeing and understanding and reveal how you understand more or less today how you feel today this is the way direct to home with ourselves. Just you have your heart want to back home and your heart is enough for everything. Enough, enough, enough. Then you're already back home. And before we finish this session, just reveal your feeling. How you feel the calmness this session? How you get awareness, understanding in your heart? And how you see the knower who does not move, but all defilement move all desire move can you free the knower from all moving object when you can free the, the knower from the moving object that is desire and all attachment he wake up with full consciousness with knowing and understanding and letting go you feel your heart opening or wake up inside more and more and you don't have to watch the breathing you stay at home you know your breathing automatically you don't have to watch the rising falling you stay at home you know the rising falling automatically that is equanimity of mind okay equanimity of mind now today you got experience regarding equanimity of mind 
there already you are knowing you know already there the breathing even you don't try to know you can know okay if your mind clean clear and pure and it become equality of mind not go left not go right the equity the equality of mind not moving is only clear knowing thing as they are not thing not expectation in your heart can you find the equality of mind you got everybody got now this view view help you get more improved by yourself by understanding by realization the quality uh, you got from the practice okay before you practice but you never realize the quality how you got today you realize the quality in all directions then you can go home in any direction okay smile can go home relax can go home loving kindness can go home letting go can go home watch the breathing in and out can go home watch the rising falling can go home so that's why i have more development of wisdom to see how to go home differently differently i have no style because i can go home i know my home i can go any any channel to my home any any access to home because i know my home already my home is dhamma i wake up with seeing with understanding when i just uh, say to my heart back home i got knowing seeing in one second okay now we finish this session thank you sadhu sadhu sadhu